This week on Skilled to Work, being an EMT isn't something you can learn to do overnight. It takes life-saving knowledge and a commitment to serve your community. MC, the ambulance service here in Madison County, started an in-house EMT program to prepare young adults for careers in emergency medical services. Way 31's Olivia Schuler tells us how the Academy is shaping Hempsey's next EMTs. For Amber Lee and Erica, being an EMT is what they call their dream job. You see it in movies, but seeing it in real life makes it like special. Now I've got the opportunity to pursue my dream career with this program without the burden of college loans. A 10 week hands on program with clinical rotations, labs and lectures. In labs is where they apply the hands on skills that they've learned to be able to actually manage a person who's having a medical uh, or traumatic emergency. D. Kelsey, the chief operations officer for Hemsey, says the idea for the academy came from a program in Philadelphia called the Freedom House. The original program was started in a minority neighborhood struggling to find ambulance services to fill the need. We wanted to kind of mimic that so that we could give a chance to people who are uh, socioeconomically disadvantaged or maybe recently displaced workers who might not otherwise have had a chance to go to a local community college for an EMT program. The program free to students. Students actually get paid during the program and have a short obligation to work at HEMC following the academy. No, we've definitely had some staffing challenges and this is going to help us meet those needs so that we can get our numbers of EMTs up. Amber Lee and her peers are gearing up for their exam. Once they pass, they'll get a national registry certification and apply for their state license. You can do it on a mannequin all day long, but when you actually do it on a real person, I don't know, it just kind of makes it click. They even put me up to the challenge. A win for Hemsey and a win for the students looking to land their dream job. Reporting in Huntsville, Olivia Schuler, Way 31 News. This first EMT Academy ends next week. The next Academy will start in September.